Have you ever wondered how those beautiful time-lapse videos are made? Well, let's unravel the mystery of this captivating art form. Time-lapse video is a cinematographic technique where the frequency at which film frames are captured, or the frame rate, is much lower than that used to view the sequence. The result? A stunning illusion of time speeding up. It's like fast-forwarding reality, capturing hours, days, or even weeks into mere seconds of footage. This technique breathes life into the inanimate and offers a unique perspective on the world around us. From tracking the blooming of a flower in a nature documentary, to documenting the progress of a skyscraper's construction, to capturing the mesmerizing dance of the stars in the night sky, time-lapse has revolutionized the way we perceive time and motion. Now that we understand what a time-lapse video is, let's dive into the different types of time-lapses. Did you know there are several types of time-lapse videos? Let's dive into some of these fascinating categories. First off, we have event time-lapses. These are great for capturing long events, such as a bustling city day in a condensed form, allowing us to witness the ebb and flow of life in mere minutes. Next, we have construction time-lapses. Ever seen a skyscraper grow from the ground up in a few seconds? That's the power of a construction time-lapse. Then there are celestial time-lapses. These are the stars of the show, literally. They capture stunning celestial events like the movement of stars or the dance of the northern lights. Lastly, we have plant growth time-lapses. These offer a unique glimpse into nature's slow and beautiful rhythm, revealing the blooming of a flower or the sprouting of a seed in a way we could never see in real time. With that understanding of the different types of time-lapses, let's move on to how you can create your own using a smartphone. Creating a time-lapse video with your smartphone is simpler than you might think. This handy device you carry around all day has the potential to create some truly awe-inspiring visuals. Let's delve into the process. First and foremost, stability is key as time-lapse videos are a series of photos taken over a considerable amount of time, even the slightest shake can throw off your entire video. A tripod or any steady surface can work as your makeshift stabilizer. If you don't have a tripod, get creative. Use a stack of books or a window ledge, anything that keeps your phone steady for a prolonged period. Next, you need to choose your subject wisely. The magic of time-lapse shines when capturing slow, subtle changes. Cloud movements, bustling city streets, a blooming flower, or even melting ice, these make for captivating time-lapse subjects. So, take a moment and think about what you want to capture. Once you've got your setup right and your subject chosen, it's time to discuss intervals. This is the time gap between each shot your phone captures. A general rule of thumb is the slower the subject, the longer the interval. For fast-moving subjects, a few seconds will do. But if you're capturing the slow crawl of shadows or the bloom of a flower, you might want to set your intervals to several minutes. Now, once you've captured the raw frames, it's time for the final step, editing. Many smartphones come with built-in editing tools, but there are also numerous apps available that can help you compile your photos into a single seamless video. Play around with the speed and add some music if you like. Remember, this is your project. Make it a reflection of your vision. That's how you create a stunning time-lapse with just your smartphone. But what if you want to use a camera? If you're looking to make a time-lapse video with a camera, you're in the right place. First things first, you'll want to secure your camera on a tripod to ensure stability throughout the shooting process. A steady camera is key to capturing a seamless flow of images. Now let's talk about the camera settings. You need to set your camera to manual mode. This gives you control over the aperture, shutter speed, and ISO, allowing you to maintain a consistent exposure throughout the time-lapse. The aperture controls the depth of field. A smaller aperture, denoted by a higher F number, will give you a wider depth of field, meaning more of the scene will be in focus. The shutter speed controls how long the camera's shutter is open. For time-lapse photography, you'll generally want a slower shutter speed. This will give your video a smoother, more cinematic look. As for ISO, keep it as low as possible to reduce noise. Next, let's talk about intervals. The interval is the amount of time between each photo. This depends on what you're shooting. If you're capturing a fast-moving scene, like a busy city street, you'll want a shorter interval. For slower scenes, like clouds moving across the sky, a longer interval is appropriate. Remember, the shorter the interval, the smoother the motion in the final video. Once you've captured your images, it's time to head into the editing room. Use video editing software to compile your images into a video. Most software will allow you to adjust the frame rate. 
A higher frame rate will make the video play back faster, while a lower frame rate will slow it down. Play around with it until you find what looks best. Don't forget to add some music to your video. It can help set the mood and make your time-lapse more engaging. There's plenty of royalty-free music available online, so you're sure to find something that fits your video perfectly. Now you know how to make a time-lapse video using a camera. Let's summarize what we've learned. Now that we've covered the process of making a time-lapse video, let's recap. In the last few minutes, we've journeyed together through the fascinating world of time-lapse videos. We started with understanding the concept of time-lapse, a technique where the frequency of frames captured is far lower than that used to view the sequence. This creates an illusion of time passing swiftly, transforming hours into seconds and making the world move at a speed that our eyes normally can't perceive. It's like a magic trick, a beautiful deception of time that lets us witness the slow dance of the stars, the bustling life of a city, or the blossoming of a flower in mere moments. We then explored the different types of time-lapse. Remember, there's the static time-lapse, where the camera remains in one position, capturing the world as it changes around it. Then we have the hyperlapse, an exciting variation where the camera moves considerable distances, adding an extra layer of dynamism to the footage. And don't forget the holy grail of time-lapses, the day-to-night transition, a challenging but rewarding type that showcases the transition from light to dark in a single sequence. Moving on, we delved into the process of creating a time-lapse using a smartphone. It's a simple and accessible method that allows anyone to dip their toes into the world of time-lapse. We talked about the importance of a stable surface or a tripod, selecting the right interval for your time-lapse, and the use of inbuilt or third-party time-lapse apps. With a little patience and creativity, you can create captivating time-lapses right at your fingertips. Next, we shifted gears to talk about making a time-lapse using a traditional camera. This method offers more control and higher quality, but it also demands a bit more from its creator. We discuss the essentials, a sturdy tripod, an intervalometer, and the right settings on your camera. We also touched upon the importance of shooting in RAW for the best post-processing flexibility, and the process of stitching together your images into a seamless time-lapse video in editing software. Every time-lapse is a unique blend of artistry, patience, and technical skill. Whether you're using a smartphone or a camera, whether you're capturing a bustling cityscape or a tranquil sunset, the process remains essentially the same. It's about observing the world, selecting a scene and compressing time to create a visual spectacle. We hope this guide helps you create your own stunning time-lapse videos. Until next time, keep exploring and keep creating.